In this class, we're going to cover the basics of how stepper motors work, how you drive them, how you control them, and all the fun things you could do with them. We use stepper motors in almost every job we do. They're incredibly useful, they let you be incredibly precise, and they're reasonably priced. There's jobs that require a big six-axis robot like our Bolt, but there's plenty of things you could do with simple stepper motors with a little smart ingenuity. So let's dig into the different parts of a stepper motor system. First and foremost, you need some sort of software. The software is what's going to let you program what the motor does. There's a wide range of choices. Here at the garage, we use Flare software, which you could download from Mark Roberts Motion Control. After the software, the next link in the chain is the controller or the decoder that's going to take in the information from the computer and from the software and output step and direction signal to your motor driver. This is something like this Technic ClearCore box that we use here at the garage, or you could use from DragonFrame a DMC16, or you could actually use something as simple as an Arduino. Once you have your software and your controller, the next step in the line is your driver. So this will take in the step and direction signal from the controller and will actually output the power to the motor itself. These come in a wide range of sizes and powers, but you have to choose the right one for the motor and the project that you're creating. From the driver, you'll run a cable to a motor. There's a wide range of motors as you see here in all shapes and sizes depending on your use. We're going to break that all down for you in the next chapters. Then the funnest part of all is to see what you want to move with these motors. You could do a wide range of things from spin a turntable to move a linear mover somehow or spin something, drop something. There's so many things you could do with these stepper motors. Like right here, I could make this thing spin. Woo! So fun. But we'll get into all that in the next chapters, so hold on.